you know me. Big yeah, time take over. 20 win is the year we get it in. Avax Music Entertainment. You feel me? That's what's up, man. That's what's up, man. My boy doing it big. And I know you just recently had a uh, uh, show at Dream World. Everything with your boy Bone, man. You know, tell us a little bit about that right there, man. I mean, first off, I want to uh, thank Dream World. They showed me a lot of love after the January 2nd. I had a uh, showcase out there. And then we went back out there and did the Bone concert. Uh, coming up, we're going to do it with Tuck. You feel me? Um, it was cool, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I fooled with Bone. Yeah, yeah. In the Dallas, I was trying to get it. Uh, you know? uh, <laughs> that's what's up, man. I'm telling you, man, he looking to look, man, he doing his thing, man. I'm telling you, man, he look like a star. And I know a lot of, you know, we was talking a little yeah. bit. We met back in the day and uh, back well, last week sometime. And we were talking about how you was with them guys, man. Yeah. First of all, before we get into that, man, let the people know a little bit about Jet, man, how you came up with the name, you know, where you're from, all that good <laughs> stuff, man. All right, man. Dallas, Texas, born and raised, man. I call it Dallas, Texas, because we get money in this city. You feel me? Um, I'm, I'm raised in the Holland Hills sector. Excuse me. I call it the city capital. You feel me? Um, you know what I'm saying? Hood raised. Um, you know, Dallas till I die. You know, uh, grew up in Holland Hills, went to Skyline High School in the Grove. Uh, I started rapping with Tum Tum, yeah, man. Tum Tum okay. and uh, Fat B. Okay. A couple of the double T. You know, we started together. You know okay. what I'm saying? Uh, did you know that in high school, you know, was known for the freestyles. So you can ask anybody in that, in that vicinity about me with the freestyle back in the G. That was 10 years ago, though. But yeah. uh, I've been getting it in, man. Uh, went, to the, went to the Navy, came back home, and uh, the flow ground. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, when you, when you went back, when you left, you know, and, and, and I know it's in your bio that you left for a little, you know, four years, yeah. you came back. Was anything different? I mean, you know, I mean, being in the military, man, being around different genres, like, like them cats from Chicago and Philly, them cats can really rap, you know what I'm saying? And, uh -huh. you know, we, we would rap on, on and, and get in cyphers and things of that nature. And uh, when you do that, man, either you got to, you know, be good or, or, or get ran over. Yeah. And, and, and in, that, in that vicinity, I had to represent for Dallas, you know what I'm saying? Showing Dallas and, and Texas in a whole wasn't on just man hold up at the time. Which we would stereotype that, you feel me? Right, right. Yeah. Dang, so would you say, I mean, I know you've been with them cats, and I mean, how, how did you feel, like, when, you know, when Tom Tyler, you was rapping with them guys, and, yeah. you know, they got made a name for themselves, man, what what, what kind of, how did you feel when they started getting out there, and then they kind of like, you like, back there, like, okay, what's, what's really going on, I mean, you know? I mean, I, uh, still, it was a little sour at first, but, you know, it come back around, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Okay. The, the tortoise went the race, though. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 it went nowhere. You know what I'm saying? It went nowhere, man. We're going to answer this line real quick, man, and see, see what's going on. Huh? Probably somebody I know. <laughs> well, we got to call him, man. We're going to we're gonna take it to the phone and see what people think, man. Carla, you on the air of Sizeville Radio. What's your name? Hello? <laughs> Hello? Hello? How you doing? <laughs> J2T. That's what's up. That's what's up. Say, I, I, if you listen to the radio, if you, if you listen to the computer right now, we're going to kind of ask you to kind of go in another room because if, you, if you're listening to us on the radio, it's going to give you a little delay. So we want you to, uh, so we want you to actually, you know, actually give a little, little chance, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, you got any questions for, for Jeff? You got any questions for Jeff? <laughs> yeah, I do. Uh, man, ain't that something? Well, how, well, how you feeling about the music? Yeah. Well, that's what's up. That's what's up. Well, you got you got any encouraging words for you, boy? Yeah. <laughs> uh, really? So what what you what 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 do you know? What do you, what do you know? Anything, anything funny about Jeff that you can tell us real quick? <laughs> yeah. Any, any funny any. <laughs> I wanna yeah. be a problem with bully. With what? Yeah. With a bully. <laughs> nah, I ain't never had no problem with no bully, man. I was yeah. bully. <laughs> <laughs> That's what's up, that's what's up, man. Like I said, I, we sure we sure appreciate you calling in, man, showing the love to Jet, man. You know, you know you already know him and everything, so you yeah. know it's all good. We definitely appreciate the call, you know what I'm saying? You got any shout outs you wanna give to anybody else? <laughs> okay, well that's what's up. That's what's up. We surely appreciate it. Thank you so much for calling. Yeah, we do. Uh, appreciate that. Uh, bye bye.
man. I tell you, boy, I tell you, it's what it is, man. You ain't got no headphones, man. It kind of make kind of wild, because you know, you, see, you wonder why people, when they're in radio, they have headphones, man. When you ain't got no headphones, you gotta get lost a little bit in everything, you know. You so, all by yourself, huh? Yeah, man. So, uh, so, yeah, yeah, man, tell us a little bit about what you got going on with uh, your future projects, man, and uh, you know who you be working with. What's what's really happening? Man, what it is, man, it's, it's elevated music entertainment, not to be confused or associated with anything other. AME. Yeah, AME, you feel me? Um, it's me, um, Akron Watson, you feel me? I rap, he sing, he do his thing, you feel me? Oh, yeah. Uh, and, and what we got coming out, man, I got, I got I got a couple other people that, you know what I'm saying, they in the work, second base, Lenore, um, Lil Trey, shout out to Lil Trey. Um, but what we got coming out, man, we finna drop this mixtape. It's a, it's a street album, really, you know what I'm saying, because it's all original beats. Um, we're gonna let it go, it's gonna be called 20 Win the Mixtape. Okay. Yeah. Um, be looking for that February, really All Star weekend. We in there tough on that, man. man. Mind consuming, you feel me? And then, um, okay. late first quarter, top of the second, um, I'm gonna drop the solo album. You feel Dang. me? Um, A Bed Music, self title. Yeah. And, and that mean we're gonna fly. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm just. I'm just I was just about to ask you, you know what I'm saying? What, what aviator music, man? You know I mean, what I'm, I'm legit, man. Like, <laughs> so, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Uh, I, I live Leonardo DiCaprio, the game, you feel me? I fly through with the aviator, you know what I'm saying? Already. <laughs> <That's laughs> catch, catch me if you can, you dig? <laughs> yes, yeah, sir. Do we have one of these cuts already ready for us right now, man? Man, we got uh, for TV. For TV? Yeah, and, and I say it's for TV, man. Some some uh, wise man labeled me as the Jet Show. Okay. So, uh, I, I, I made the world my, my uh, BET, so I do this for TV. Check me out, 100. That's what's Shit. up, man. What, what made you come up with this song right here, man? You know, kind of lead us into it real quick. I mean, you know how cats say they flash or they fly? You know what I'm saying? Check me out, take a picture. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right. I do it for TV. Okay. You, you're going to watch me when you see me. Okay. You know what I'm saying? You ain't got to look. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you going to automatically be taking yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Frank Mueller. Fossil, I know uh -huh. they watch. Yeah. <laughs> That's what's yeah. up, man. That's really what's going on, man. If y'all just tune in, but listen to our boy, The Jet, man, right out of D-Town, Texas, so man, doing it real big, man. I'm telling you, man, Money Town, Texas, doing it big right now. If we get that first cut for TV by our boy, Jet, man. Check this out, man. We'll be right back. Yo, what's up, man? And I know we just, we just man, we just got this playing that heard about me, man. What, what made you come up with that, man? That is hot, dog. <laughs> I gotta get that one, man, to my, my producer, man, DJ Uzi T, the flag. Shout out to my dude right there. He, uh, we, we just, we had the beat, man, and we just going back and forth on, on, on ideas, simple ideas, you know what I'm saying? Because as a lyricist, in my, my mind kind of moved too, too, too far ahead of simple ideas. <laughs> right, right. So, uh, he, he kind of was like, what about saying you ain't heard about it? And I came up with the hook. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, he ain't getting no points out of it. Yeah. He don't get enough out of production. He did. Majority of the album, you feel me? Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah man. The track's on point, man. Appreciate on fire, it, man. Team, man. 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 So, I mean, do you actually do, you know, I know a lot of people, they write first, they come up with the track. I mean, what is your formula for, I mean, for a hot song? I, I mean, I, not to sound like uh, another like, major artist, but I don't, I don't really write much. You know what I'm saying? So, uh -huh. I just hear the beat. It's contemplated. I think about it. You know what I'm saying? But I don't really write much down. Because if you write it down, you're gonna have to come back and, and memorize it anyway. You know what I'm saying? It it it, it boosts your um, delivery uh -huh. and, and also, you know what I'm saying, how you you know what I'm saying, the punctuality of the words and, and even the swag on, on, on what you're saying when you when you know it already. Oh, okay. So you did? Yeah, yeah, man, I'm telling you, man, you, you the way you formulate the way your words, your, your pronunciation, the way, you know, a lot of people say it's not what you say, it's how you say it, especially in the music business, man. Your delivery is, is everything, man. What, what do you think about that? I mean, <laughs> you know, they, they say it's 90% uh, business, 10% talent, but you can tell who said that, they lie, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Even, even, <laughs> even them cats out there that, that's getting on with the dance song, you know what I'm saying? They talent is what getting them on their mindset, you know what I'm saying? They might have, not have the best talent, uh -huh. you know what I'm saying? But that's their talent. You know what I'm saying? They they might not have a business mind. They they might just have a talent. So, um, right. when when you deliver music and you know what I'm saying, like you gotta make you gotta make people feel what you're saying. You know what I'm saying? No doubt. And, and, and it, ain't, it ain't like they can see you, you know what huh. unless you got a video for it. So through right. that radio, you gotta make the people feel and understand what you're saying. And the only way you can do that is through punctuality, uh, delivering. You know how you even pronounce a word. You feel me? Real talk. 